So I just, I just thought it had to happen. So, so listen for the deflagration. Oh, oh my goodness! <laughs> You've scared the little children. <laughs> Yay! Do it again. Says. <laughs> okay, now we know what. Oh no, they're running up here. OSHA says that uh, this is not dangerous to your hearing, but it is fairly loud. No, no, wait, it's And it's got to create an echo in the echo tube as well. All right? Yes. So, uh... Ready? Oh! 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 That was great. That was awesome. Let's see what the picture is. If only we, did you feel it? If only we had a bigger balloon. If only. Now that's a baseball. <laughs> 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 I don't usually do them this big, all right? Uh, I, I really am a little nervous about doing the one this big. I like nine yeah. inches better. How many so, inches is that? I'll do it. How many inches is that? Uh, that's probably 12. How did you? And, no. And and you see why oops, and you see why I use the meter stick. Did you feel the warmth? <laughs> so the Hindenburg. The Hindenburg is this giant bag, much bigger than that, full of hydrogen. And lately they've discovered that the paint that they used on the outside of the Graf Zeppelin was an aluminum particulate paint. And aluminum metal, once it starts burning, also burns tremendously hot. So it was a combination? So it was a combination of the hydrogen going off and that ignited the aluminum. And so it was both a hydrogen explosion. And you see, you know, that, was a, that was tiny compared to the Graf Zeppelin. Oh yeah. And hopefully you heard the echo in the tube. Yeah, we did. So, questions? Yay! Thank you. Thank you. I still have the hair in my arm. <laughs>